The Big Bang Theory, long considered the cornerstone of modern cosmology, has recently faced challenges to its validity due to groundbreaking discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. This state-of-the-art telescope has unveiled new information that is revolutionizing our understanding of physics and the universe. The recent image captured by the JWST has sparked intense debate among experts, providing compelling evidence that has surprised many and put an end to numerous speculations. This visually stunning discovery has the potential to fundamentally transform our perception of the cosmos, addressing some of the most profound questions in astrophysics, such as the age of the universe and its rate of expansion. For decades, scientists across generations have been puzzled by the mysteries surrounding the universe's origins, its evolution, and its ultimate fate. Cosmologists, who study the universe on the largest scales, seek to answer questions about how the universe began, how it functions, how it has changed over time, and how it might end. Over the past century, significant progress has been made in this field, with the Big Bang theory emerging as the most widely accepted explanation for the universe's origins. According to this theory, the universe began approximately 13.8 billion years ago from an extremely hot and dense state and has been expanding ever since. However, the recent findings from the JWST are challenging some of the fundamental assumptions of this theory, prompting scientists to reconsider what they know about the cosmos. One of the key pieces of evidence supporting the Big Bang theory is the Hubble constant, a value that represents the rate at which the universe is expanding. Measuring the Hubble constant, however, is not a straightforward task. Scientists use two primary methods to calculate this value, local measurements and measurements of the early universe. Local measurements involve observing objects in space, such as stars and type IA supernovae, which serve as standard candles due to their consistent brightness. By measuring the distance to these objects and their redshift, astronomers can estimate the Hubble constant. On the other hand, measurements of the early universe rely on data from the cosmic microwave background, CMB, radiation, the afterglow of the Big Bang. This radiation, discovered in the 1960s, provides a snapshot of the universe when it was just 380,000 years old. By analyzing the tiny fluctuations in temperature and polarization within the CMB, scientists can infer the universe's age and expansion rate. Despite the precision of these methods, there is a significant problem. The results from local measurements and CMB data do not align. Local measurements suggest that the universe is expanding faster than the CMB data indicate. This discrepancy, known as the Hubble tension, has left scientists baffled and has become one of the most pressing issues in modern cosmology. Researchers have been working tirelessly to understand why these two methods yield different results. Some speculate that the discrepancy may be due to unknown factors in our current understanding of the universe, while others suggest that there may be errors in one or both methodologies. Regardless of the cause, the Hubble tension highlights the complexity of the universe and the limitations of our current knowledge. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unprecedented capabilities, is playing a crucial role in addressing these challenges. By peering deeper into space than ever before, the JWST has revealed new elements, planets, and galaxies that were previously beyond our reach. Scientists had hoped that the data collected by the JWST would help resolve the Hubble tension by providing more accurate measurements of the universe's expansion rate. However, the initial findings have only added to the mystery. The data from the JWST has revealed unexpected phenomena that do not align with our existing models, suggesting that our understanding of the universe may be incomplete. This has led to speculation that we may need to rethink some of the fundamental principles of cosmology. One possibility is that the universe contains unknown particles or forces that influence its expansion. Dark energy, an enigmatic force that accelerates the expansion of the universe, is one such candidate. While dark energy is a key component of our current cosmological models, its nature remains poorly understood. The JWST's discoveries may provide new insights into dark energy and its role in shaping the universe. Additionally, the telescope's observations could lead to the discovery of new particles or forces that have yet to be detected. These findings could revolutionize our understanding of physics and cosmology, opening up new avenues of research and exploration. The evolution of our understanding of the universe has been marked by a series of groundbreaking discoveries. For example, the discovery of the cosmic microwave background radiation in 1965 provided strong evidence for the Big Bang theory, fundamentally changing our perception of the universe. Prior to this discovery, many scientists believed that the universe was eternal and unchanging. However, the CMB data showed that the universe had a definite beginning and has been expanding ever since. Similarly, in the late 1990s, observations of distant supernovae revealed that the universe's expansion is accelerating, leading to the discovery of dark energy.
Each new discovery has challenged our existing knowledge and prompted us to develop new theories and models to explain the observed phenomena. The Hubble tension is not the only challenge facing cosmologists today. Another related issue is the distribution of matter in the universe, often referred to as S8 tension. This concept deals with how matter is clustered and dispersed throughout space. By studying the distribution of galaxies and galaxy clusters, scientists can create a map of the universe's large-scale structure and track how it has evolved over time. Some regions of space are densely packed with galaxies, while others are relatively empty. Understanding this distribution is crucial for developing accurate models of the universe's evolution. One method used to study the distribution of matter is gravitational lensing, a phenomenon in which the gravitational field of a massive object, such as a galaxy cluster, bends the light from a more distant object. This effect allows astronomers to map the distribution of dark matter, which does not emit light and is therefore invisible to traditional telescopes. By analyzing the distortions caused by gravitational lensing, scientists can infer the presence and distribution of dark matter in the universe. Another approach involves studying the cosmic microwave background radiation, which provides information about the early universe's density fluctuations. These fluctuations served as the seeds for the formation of galaxies and galaxy clusters. However, there is a discrepancy between the distribution of matter observed in the early universe and the distribution seen today. The CMB data suggests that the early universe was relatively uniform, with small density fluctuations that grew over time to form the large-scale structures we see today. In contrast, observations of the current universe reveal a more clumpy distribution of matter, with significant variations in density. This inconsistency suggests that there may be gaps in our understanding of how matter has evolved over time. Some scientists believe that dark matter and dark energy may play a role in this discrepancy, but their exact nature and influence remain unclear. The James Webb Space Telescope is helping to address these questions by providing more detailed and accurate observations of the universe. Its advanced instruments allow scientists to study cosmic distances with unprecedented precision, shedding light on the distribution of matter and the effects of dark energy. For example, the JWST has been used to observe distant galaxy clusters and measure the effects of gravitational lensing with greater accuracy than ever before. These observations are helping scientists refine their models of the universe's evolution and better understand the role of dark matter and dark energy. Despite the progress made by the JWST, many questions remain unanswered. The discrepancies between different measurements and observations suggest that there may be fundamental flaws in our current understanding of the universe. As Ray, a leading cosmologist, noted in an interview with an astronomical magazine, somewhere between these two observations, there must be a fundamental flaw in our understanding of the universe. This sentiment reflects the challenges and excitement of modern cosmology, as scientists strive to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. The study of dark matter and dark energy is one of the most active areas of research in cosmology. While black holes have traditionally been used to explain certain gravitational effects, there is growing interest in exploring how dark matter and dark energy might influence these phenomena. Dark matter, which makes up about 27% of the universe, is thought to provide the gravitational glue that holds galaxies together. Dark energy, which accounts for about 68% of the universe, is believed to be responsible for the accelerated expansion of the universe. However, the nature of these components remains elusive, and their interactions with ordinary matter are not well understood. The James Webb Space Telescope is providing new opportunities to study these enigmatic components. By observing distant galaxies and galaxy clusters, scientists can gather data on the distribution of dark matter and the effects of dark energy. These observations may help to resolve some of the discrepancies in our current models and provide new insights into the nature of the universe. For example, the JWST's observations of gravitational lensing are helping scientists map the distribution of dark matter with greater precision, while its studies of distant supernovae are providing new data on the expansion rate of the universe. As we continue to explore the universe, each new discovery brings us closer to understanding its origins and evolution. The challenges posed by the Hubble tension and S8 tension highlight the complexity of the cosmos and the limitations of our current knowledge. However, these challenges also drive scientific progress, pushing researchers to develop new tools and techniques to explore the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope is a testament to this spirit of exploration, providing unprecedented insights into the cosmos and opening up new frontiers for discovery. In conclusion, the recent discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope are revolutionizing our understanding of the universe. From challenging the validity of the Big Bang theory to shedding light on the mysteries of dark matter and dark energy, these findings are reshaping the field of cosmology. While many questions remain unanswered, the progress made by the JWST is a testament to the power of scientific inquiry and the human desire to understand the cosmos. 
As we continue to explore the universe, we can look forward to new discoveries that will deepen our understanding of the cosmos and our place within it.